Hey, I'm Joel Wanasek, and we're gonna dig into JW Bus Glue Drums. So here's the drum compressor. It's got two modes, the standard and the pumping mode on a very quick, easy switchable button. Pumping is modeled after my Roll Music Super Stereo bus compressor over here. This thing is extremely punchy and open and it's got a lot of punch and slam. And it's a very fun compressor to use when you have a slower type style tempo with a lot of space in between the transients. Uh, standard is based off a Pi compressor and with a few modifications and things like that. but. It's designed to kind of sound a little bit splatty where this is a little bit more open and punchy. I would use the standard on most things, but the um, pump and compressor is when you want a huge smashing, really aggressive, usually like rock or EDM kind of sound. So let's dial it in real quick. You can clearly hear the difference between the two sounds. Now, there's a very important thing to notice about this compressor is that it has auto makeup gain compensation. So as I move the crush down, so think of this as like the threshold, um, the volume is gonna stay the same. So you can hear the compression and not a massive jump in output as you're smashing it. So let's have a listen. And that will help you make a much better decision on the amount of compression that you're using on your drum bus. I would recommend using this, for example, on your shells. I mean, you can do it in your cymbals at it, but generally, I really like the glue and the punch that this gives drums on the shell bus. So that's how I like to use it. Let's hear it on a heavier track. So that's the JW Bus Glue drum compressor in action. <laughs> 